like a shout. Me o de le pariwo, moti yo. I've been turning out great. Our first ingredient is a blended eweru. You can get it in a supermarket or any store or in the market. Our second ingredient is the uda seed. You just smash it and then you put in your pepper soup. And of course, our lemon grass, guys. This will take your pepper soup from a zero to a one thousand. This special spice was given to me by my friend. Trust me, it did a lot of work. I don't know the name, but I'm sure you can get it in the market if you find it. It's not scarce. Also, we have our catfish already washed with salt and hot water. You can also see our blended pepper and onions. I know, right? I love onions a lot. So we have red and yellow onions in here for color, and also some blade, some sliced <laughs> onions you can see in the tray. And of course, our scent leaves. Guys, do not underestimate the power of Magista. This will take your Nigerian local dishes from zero to a one thousand in an empty pot carefully and gently put in your washed fish you know catfish is soft so you have to take care of it else it will just scatter ensure you use a bigger pot i do not have a bigger pot but just ensure you use a bigger pot if you have one do not own your gas or your stove now this gas is not on i'm just placing it on the on i'm just placing the pot on the gas this is your already mashed uda seed i mashed it you don't have to blend it you can use mortar just mash it a little see me going in with my onions just a little and then my pepper mix so i will be pouring all of this just a little is fine because i don't want the pepper soup to be too spicy but if it needs more i can always add up okay guys so let's go <laughs> let's start cooking guys so um now just going with your native spice you'll find this anywhere i don't know what it is called i tried to google the name but i can't even find it but you shall find it in the market it's not a scarce commodity okay guys <laughs> so the next ingredients we'll be going in with is our lemon grass ensure you tie your lemon grass just like this um so it does not scatter so you don't want your lemon grass to be everywhere in your pot that is not nice though. so just put it just by the pot tied just like that also you're going with this spice it's called lasso it's, it's sold for 100 naira in the market not expensive a teaspoon of this is fine it adds its own flavor to your pepper soup you know what makes pepper soup nice is when it has that you know traditional local village vibes <laughs> oh this recipe is the bomb trust me guys going with your salt i decided to play safe this is actually small salt if i need more we'll definitely add later on in this video okay guys so you can add salt according to your preference now also a teaspoon of a roux, like the blended a roux that i showed you guys earlier is fine you don't want your pepper soup to be too spicy or too cork you understand you must have had that kind of pepper soup but you know what i'm talking about it's time to go in with your water i usually do not like to do a lot of water but it's okay guys if you have seen this video to this point and you have not yet subscribed what are you waiting for please support my ministry by subscribing join this family of god and the lord will bless you <laughs> it's time to go in with um the cubes your seasoning cubes so i'm just doing two cubes of maggie which is okay for this dish i don't think i would need more because i'm just working with one fish if the fishes were more definitely the seasonings would be more okay because the quantity of the water will be different see me again still going with, with onions ah, i should like this onion so much <laughs> see beauty see yellow pepper has a way of adding beauty and color to your dish so ensure you always add yellow pepper in your pepper soup and also the aroma and color ah, the aroma is out of this world see beauty guys so when you are done just cover it and allow it to cook for just 10 minutes viola it's already 10 minutes that we are back so i'm here to check on my pepper soup don't mind me guys don't mind me i'm using spoon please 
resist the urge to use spoon you can use toning gari what's the english name for toning gari you should know what i'm talking about you can use toning gari and then i decided to test to be sure our ingredients are balanced <laughs> i realized that i needed a little salt so i went in with just a little salt to balance the taste of this our pepper soup okay guys see it's coming up it's coming up so it's fish so you don't you don't need to overcook it you don't need to overcook it about 15 20 minutes is fine like <laughs> you don't need to keep this in the pot to be cooking for 30 whole hour away 90 and film <laughs> so you cover and allow it to simmer just for a while and then you open and there is one ingredient that i did not show you guys i did not tell you people and this ingredient is the special ingredient is the grandma's recipe and it is blended crayfish just a little blended crayfish in your pepper soup will turn it into a pot of wonders this is what this is the icing on the cake <laughs> if you don't put crayfish in your pepper soup i don't know why you're doing no i don't know why you're doing no pepper soup Crayfish is a pepper soup will give you that grandma's taste of pepper soup. Like, oh my god, let me not even talk too much because this <laughs> this catfish pepper soup tasted really nice. Really nice. In fact, I had to go and hide some because <laughs> my family members wanted to finish it. <laughs> See me feeling myself. It tasted so good. We are done. Like, we are done the last ingredient to go in is the scent leaf so this is the last thing that would go in and then you just allow it to simmer for just a second it's, it's okay just what am i even saying no what not a second one minute is okay just a few seconds you allow it to simmer just for a while and then you off the gas your food is ready <laughs> so simple not expensive this entire pepper soup did not cost me up to 4,000 there are no mm -mm. it didn't cost me up to 4,000 are very cost effective yummy you can see the pepper soup looking so nice you can have this with rice you can have this with agidi you can have this with yam or plantain if you have seen this video if you have seen this video till this point and you have not yet subscribed ask a job pico help my ministry subscribe drop me a message in the comment section